The renin-angiotensin-aldosterone system, RAS, is a hormonal system that controls blood pressure. While barrel reflux is a short-term response to sudden changes in blood pressure, RAS is responsible for long-term regulation. In the kidneys, within the walls of afferent arterioles, there are specialized cells producing pro-renin called juxtaglomerular cells. Upon activation by a drop in blood pressure, pro-renin is cleaved to form renin, which is released into the blood. Renin converts a plasma protein called angiotensinogen, produced by the liver, into angiotensin 1, a peptide of 10 amino acids. Angiotensin 1 is further converted into angiotensin 2, an 8 amino acid peptide, by the angiotensin converting enzyme, ACE, predominantly present in the lungs and kidneys. Angiotensin 2 is a hormone. It binds to angiotensin 2 receptors in tissues to exert various effects. It stimulates vasoconstriction in systemic arterioles. It promotes sodium reabsorption in proximal convoluted tubules of the kidneys. It induces the release of aldosterone from the adrenal cortex. Aldosterone promotes sodium and water retention in the kidneys. In the central nervous system, angiotensin II has several effects. It acts on the hypothalamus to stimulate thirst and encourage water intake. It induces the posterior pituitary to release antidiuretic hormone, which promotes water retention by the kidneys. It reduces the sensitivity of baroreceptor response to increased blood pressure so that this response would not counteract the effect of RAS. All these actions lead to an increase in blood volume and blood pressure. Angiotensin II is short-lived with a half-life of 1 to 2 minutes. It is degraded into angiotensin 3 and 4, which have lesser effects. Overactive or inappropriately activated RAS is a cause for hypertension. RAS is a frequent target of antihypertensive drugs. ACE inhibitors and angiotensin receptor blockers are common treatment for hypertension.